welcome to 22nd of May's God's blessing. Supreme Father says, may you remain completely pure in Brahmin life with the lesson of belonging to the One. So, purity means to have connection with the One, love for the One, expectations completely only from the One and not from everybody else around. May you remain completely pure in Brahmin life with the lesson of belonging to the One and staying in your spiritual royalty. Make the lesson of belonging to the One firm, that I belong to the Father, none other, and inculcate the royalty of purity into your Brahmin life. So purity means that you're not asking for love, peace, happiness from people around you, from relations around you. Then that is not purity. We are only expecting it from the one creator. That means purity. So into your Brahmin life and this spiritual royalty will continue through the whole cycle. If you bring that royalty of purity now, then it will carry along with us in the whole cycle. Out of all the souls from the supreme abode, the sparkle of your spiritual royalty and purity is most elevated. Uh, Baba is talking about the Param Dham, where we, when we sit, all of our souls, then there are stages of brightness of souls. So our purity and royalty is most elevated. The sparkle is very bright as compared to other souls. That's what God is saying. In the beginning period, in your form of deities, there is especially this personality. When we come down on earth, our speciality is of loyalty, sorry, royalty and purity. And that is seen when we are deities in the golden age. Then in the middle period, your images are worshipped with discipline in the right way. Because of whatsoever we do right now, with our connection with God, we improve our thoughts, words and actions. Our behavior increases and moves towards deism. That's what people remember during copper age when they start doing our worship. The basis of Brahmin life in this conference age is the royalty of purity. So purity also has a royalty and there's a level to it and that's what we learn in Brahma Kumaris. Therefore, while you live this Brahmin life, you definitely have to remain completely pure. Om Shanti.